Good morning, Roosevelt. Today is Monday, February 25th, 2013. And first, the joke of the day. A sign posted in the dentist's office said, Please be nice to the dentist. They have feelings, too. Announcements for today's little-known black history fact. Granville T. Wood was born in 1856. He was an African-American inventor who obtained more than 50 patents. He made his significant invention, a railroad telegraph system, in 1887. This system allowed crew members on moving trains to communicate with an one another and with railroad stations. It made traffic safer by helping to avoid train collisions. There will be a Black History Month celebration at George Middle School tomorrow from 5.30 to 7.30. All students and their families are invited to come for a night of music, food, dance, art, and storytelling. Once again, the application deadline for the Student Advisory Council has been pushed back. Once again, until March 8th. This is the last time we'll be pushing back the deadline. You may pick up an application form in Coach Mack's office or print out a copy from the student government website. This council is an important new addition to the way we writers reach out to one another. Please be committed and serious and apply. Thespians, if you have any Moe's clam chowder ordered, you must turn in your form with money to Miss Lane today by noon. No exceptions. Attention all seniors. For senior pictures in the yearbook, please email Miss Hughes at mhughes1 at pps.net or bring a digital file to room 264 by April 1st. No pictures will be accepted after this date. And once again, congratulations go out to Shawnee Plunkett de la Cruz, who will be Roosevelt High School's representative for this year's competition of the Talent Within Talent Search, which will be held on Friday, April 26, 2013. Shawnee will compete to win a $5,000 scholarship for college. Good luck, Shawnee. Don't forget, today is Monday, so James, one of Roosevelt's college reps, will be in the counseling center to help anything college related. Come during lunch or after school. Rough Rider Sports. Big congratulations go out to Samish Tonga Kofe for becoming the first wrestling state champion in the history of Roosevelt High School. Tonga won his state title this past Saturday at the Memorial Coliseum, winning the championship at 285 pounds in quadruple overtime. Thank you to all the friends, family, and staff members who came out to support him and Nate Hamilton as they attempted to make history. Attention all track and field participants. Don't forget, practice starts today. We need all girls and guys to come and participate in this year's team. No experience needed. If you can run, jump, throw, or just want to be part of a good team, come today at 4.30. We will meet in the wrestling room. Our motto this year is move it on up. See you Monday, and don't be late. And any students interested in playing a spring sport need to get a sports physical. Luckily, the Roosevelt Health Clinic is here to save you time and money. If you need a physical, please contact the clinic ASAP and reserve an appointment today. Today's student lesson will, is a reminder about the dress code. The way you dress and present yourself affects how others perceive you and the school as a whole. Please dress appropriately and follow the school dress code. The word of the day, hesitancy, to give pause. The young man showed no hesitancy in answering any personal questions that were asked of him while he was being interviewed for his job. And remember, as writers, we excel academically, act respectfully, and live responsibly. And it's always a great day to be a writer.